there's a lot of veterans that are in need of dental care and unfortunately are not able to obtain that through the Veterans Administrations or maybe because of being uninsured um, or unemployed. Everybody wants to have a nice, wonderful smile and they deserve it because they've worked, you know, they were committed to serving our country for us. Okay, so should we come down? Right here. Okay. Are you ready? Okay, come on back. Right. Thank you so much. We went around and interviewed uh, veterans who were interested in signing up, got their um, medical, past medical history, uh, current medical history, all that kind of stuff. Collect their vital signs and get their blood pressure and pulse prior to them getting treatment. They don't want the blood pressure too elevated because uh, it can cause a little bit more bleeding uh, than usual, so they have pretty um, tight parameters that they want. It. And right now you're not experiencing any pain, but you could experience pain and you don't want it. I was lucky to participate in this event. Uh, today what I did is I just did a, a filling for uh, one of a veteran. It means a lot to me actually. Um, I'm a veteran myself of 13 years. Uh, I've spent a lot of time with, with people like this, with uh, other veterans uh, through service and outside. And it's a major focus that I want to you know, participate in once I get out of dental school is I want to put on these types of events. I was in the Army. I was, I was a tank crewman, resident service uh, 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 person where I live at. And they're the ones that brought it to my attention. They told me that it was for veterans. Like, okay, <laughs> you know, there was no hesitation whatsoever. So you know, so this was my first step to hopefully getting, you know, a set of dentures or so. You know, it just means a lot to me. I miss smiling. We do see that a lot of them do need further advanced care, such as dentures, partials root canals, what have you, those advanced care that they're not able to obtain as easily. We'd love to be able to expand that, um, what we're doing here today, so that they can come here to the School of Dentistry and either through our pre-doctoral program or through our residency programs obtain those further treatment that's needed. So that that way they can get back out into the workforce. So we have many uh, students that are veterans here at the school. And, um, and also faculty members. So we, we wanted to get all of them involved in it, and so that's you know, why we're here today, is to give back to our fellow, fellow brothers and sisters. These people have sacrificed so much. They gave so much of their time, and um, time with their family, time away, um, just from life here. The basics, like dental work and making sure that their teeth are okay, are so important, but they don't have services like that, and many don't qualify for VA benefits for dental work. So it's important to have the opportunity to volunteer our time and um, also with the dentists all of their um, skills so that they get the work that they need. Mm -hmm.